This is the Media Matters Minute. I'm Hillary Tone. The Wall Street Journal's James Taranto dismissed the epidemic of sexual assault in the military, claiming that efforts to address the growing problem contributed to, quote, an effort to criminalize male sexuality. On the Wall Street Journal's web show, Opinion Journal Live, Taranto doubled down on his claim when discussing the blocked promotion of Lieutenant General Susan J. Helms, who granted clemency to an officer found guilty of sexual assault. Your op-ed today in the paper says that she's a, somehow a victim of a war on men. How is that? That's right. Well, this goes back to the uh, effort to combat the political campaign against sexual assault in the military. And this seems to be turning into an effort to criminalize male sexuality. James, when did this war on men begin? Can you pinpoint a, a starting point? Well, it all goes back to the beginning of contemporary feminism uh, in the early 60s. You know, women wanted to be equal to men. They wanted to be able to do all the sorts of professional things, including the military, that men could do. Taranto's discussion of the war on men is unsurprising given his history of repeatedly defending white males from, quote, anti-white bigotry. For more on this and other stories, please visit MediaMatters.org.